Assalamu alaikum alaykum friends, this is Sami and you are watching Civil Engineers YouTube channel. Dear friends, in this video lecture today, I am going to discuss about lapping length for beam and column. So this is a short video and many students, they were asking about this topic that what is the lapping length for beam and column. So if you want to watch the video, what's the difference between lapping length and development length? So the link is in the description of this video. Also watch that video. So today we will discuss lapping length for beam and column. Let's get started and don't forget to like this video and share this video with your friends. Okay, so lapping length for beam and column okay so lapping length for beam and column actually for the compression member uh, we require to do the lapping which uh, 48d okay so d is a dia of steel which we are using uh, for lapping and compression member okay 48 D for compression member. So, okay, so 40 D is for the compression member. Okay, so what is compression member? So compression member is a column. Okay, so when you want to provide the lapping length in column, okay, one steel with other. Okay, so we have to do with the formula of 48d okay for the compression member so uh, also uh, for the tension member okay so we can uh, take uh, uh, the formula 60d okay so here d is also dia of steel which we are using in uh, tension member okay for tension member So in tension member, uh, we know that in tension we have a beam, okay? So in beam, uh, uh, we can use uh, lapping length with the formula 60D, okay? And also in slab, suppose uh, we have a slab which length is uh, which length is uh, 16 meter, okay? If it, uh, uh, this is the slab, okay? And length of the slab is here. 16 meter okay but keep in your mind one thing that uh, the factories steel factories are allowed to uh, manufacture the steel just 12 meter okay they are not allowed uh, uh, to manufacture the steel more than 12 meter okay with aci okay 12 meter they are allowed to manufacture 12 meter uh, length of steel okay so actually the length of the steel is 12 meter and here we required length is our design length is 16 meter in a slab okay so here uh, we will overlap one steel with other okay so if 12 meter so we will place the other steel from here okay other steel here so this point is called what lapping length it's called lapping length okay so here we will overlap with each other two steel with each other so this is intention because this is a slab so we will do with the formula 60d for the slab and beam and 48d for the uh, column okay for longitudinal bars so uh, this is the specific formulas uh, but uh, we can use 48d and 60d uh, with the help of uh, aci SCI codes 318, okay, uh, with uh, 318, 14 code, okay. So with this uh, uh, code, we can use the given formula. So this is the important topic for today. If you need the article about this video, so the link is in the description of this video, or just visit to my website www.silverstudents.com. So thanks for watching. See you in next video. Bye bye.